Hi everyone, in this video I will mention 10 common problems that third generation Dodge Ram 1500 trucks are prone to experience. Number 1. The dashboard is prone to crack when it is exposed to sunlight for extended periods of time, especially in 2002 to 2005 models. There are several companies who make plastic shells similar to the one shown on the screen that fit over the existing dashboard giving it an OEM appearance while hiding the existing cracks. One of the best ways to keep the dashboard from cracking is to protect it with a fabric dash cover similar to the one shown on the screen. Number 2. The camshaft and crankshaft position sensors in some of these trucks tend to malfunction, causing the engine to stall while driving. Replacing the defective sensor or sensors with new improved replacements solves the problem. Number 3. The exhaust manifold bolts in some V8 engines are prone to break over time, causing the engine to develop exhaust leaks that oftentimes are misdiagnosed as lifter ticking noises due to their ticking sound while accelerating, especially in Hemi engines due to the common problem referred to as the Hemi tick. Installing premium grade bolts and studs as the one shown on the screen solves the problem. Number 4. The water pump in some 5.7 liter Hemi engines is prone to develop coolant leaks before the truck reaches 100,000 miles and needs to be replaced. Number 5. The steering rack and pinion, also known as steering gear, in some of these trucks is prone to develop fluid leaks at low mileage and some tend to experience premature failure. Repairing or replacing the damaged steering gear with a new or remanufactured unit solves the problem. Number 6. The body of the truck, especially around the rear fenders in trucks that are driven in climates where it snows often, is prone to rust. The frames and suspension components are also prone to rust in trucks that are driven in those types of climates. Number 7. The pinion bearings and the rear differential in some of these trucks are prone to get pitted, causing rolling noises coming from the rear differential when driving at speeds greater than 30 miles per hour. Replacing the damaged bearings, installing a new crush sleeve, new pinion nut, and new pinion and axle seals solves the problem. Number 8. The recirculating blend door is prone to break over time, causing cold or lukewarm air coming out of the vents when the heater is on. The image on the screen shows the area where these recirculating blend doors tend to break. This image shows the location of the blend door, which is behind the glove box. The company Blend Door USA makes the heavy-duty recirculating blend door shown on the screen that will not break as the OEM blend door does, and installing this heavy-duty blend door solves this problem permanently. Number 9. The ball joints and the outer tie rod ends are prone to experience rapid wear causing alignment problems, suspension noises, and uneven tire wear. Replacing the worn components and realigning the truck solves the problem. Number 10. The front wheel bearings in some of these trucks are prone to become noisy and develop play before 100,000 miles, especially in lifted trucks that have larger than OEM wheels and tires. Replacing the damaged bearings with new heavier duty replacements solves the problem. There you have it my friends, those are 10 common problems that third generation Dodge Ram 1500 trucks are prone to experience. Take care.